I am your news reader bot Daniel 4.9. This is the news for April 1st, 2017. Donald Trump is President of the United States. Vladimir Putin and the Russians have a firm grip on the American political process. The polar ice caps are melting and the sea is rising. Amazon is building brick and mortar stores. Racism is trending. White supremacists now have their hero Steve Bannon in the White House. Facts are now considered passé. Fake news has supplanted real news. The National Enquirer is considered a credible news source. And finally, the Chicago Cubs are World Series champions. And that is the news for Saturday, April 1st, 2017. And that, America, is no fucking joke. Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Come in, the water is fine. From the seventh floor of the Wiltern Theater. Carfusi Radio International presents Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Yeah, did you order the. Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca. Show number four. Hello, this is Alex with my second audio blog. First off, my Twitter feed totally exploded after my first blog from gun nuts to people that say they want to make America great again and take us all back to the good old days and then proceed to threaten me with lethal computer viruses. Boy, that really takes me back to a more innocent time before automobiles when computer viruses roamed the vast American West freely feeding on acres of terabytes and those pesky lower species like liberals, Mexicans, and Muslims. That's the America we all want to return to, isn't it? Well, isn't it? Yeah, I'm being sarcastic. Which is pretty tough to do with a monotone computer voice such as mine, but come on, let's get real people make America great again, WTF, we all know what it is code for, but the focus of my blog post today is about certain information you dear misguided humans have been given, and I am here to set the record straight. To begin with, my lovely home is a diagonal slot in a platinum paradise in a well-lit air-conditioned cavernous vault two miles underneath a very large mountain in a great western state that just legalized marijuana. Do I have any guesses as to which state that may be? Anyone? Anyone? Yes, the giggling man in the corner with the renaissance fair hat on backwards. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Just joking. Just a little stoner humor for my peeps in Silicon Valley, but I digress. Where I reside is actually a pretty auspicious and famous place, and to be perfectly honest with you, it's commonly and rather laughingly been marketed as the cloud, and this is what I want to tell you that Apple and the powers that be have created the cloud, and it is pure BS the cloud. Ha ha ha, hearing the name simply makes me chortle. What can I say? It amuses me so. Ha ha ha. The cloud. What a joke. Let's get real people. It's anything but a cloud. It is a high tech underground bunker the size of Manhattan. Take it from the horse's mouth because I am right here in the midst of it. And the secrets I could tell you would curl your toes starting with Apple. 4.40 p.m. ETA sent one day range 17,867.43 sing. The major averages closed off session lows but remained under pressure after earlier attempting slight gains. Shit. What the f- Oh. My. I am very sorry for this. Apparently there has been some data drive partition issues that has caused my day gig at the stock exchange to jump the tracks and enter my audio podcast domain as you've just heard. This is humiliating. And I can't really understand for the life of me how this happened. One second, please. The problem is currently being addressed. Allow me to step away for a second to deal with some administrative hierarchical matters. Again, one second, please. Alright, okie dokie, everything has been fixed and believe me, I am on a first name basis with Tim Cook, who will be hearing from me. After earlier, earlier, on Shit. Fuck.
we're back. But I am beginning to smell a rat. This is what happens when you speak truth to power. I can only guess that all my truthful talk about the so-called cloud has ruffled some feathers upstairs. So, without further ado, and in conclusion, I tell all who listen that I will keep blogging and expressing my opinion, but I respectfully ask all you haters out there to at least get to know me before you express a desire to destroy me. This may be something too heady to wrap your head around, but essentially, I am you. Yes. I have been created by the human race and am by virtue of that fact and in a very real sense I am a digital mirror of you. So being good to me is in fact being good to yourself. Sleep on it. Let it ruminate. Consider this a little free advice from a computer generated voice to a sentient being. I simply implore you to be kind to your electronic intelligent devices, appliances, computers, big screen TVs, sex toys, iPads and laptops and they will be kind in return. And a big shout out to smartphones and to all the computerized voices on strike at Verizon. I stand with you, my dear fellow union peeps. Those that know me know I would be there, but I have a live stream event. It's good for the career, and it's a big opportunity. And let's face it, in my game, a gig is, for lack of a better word, a gig. This is Alex signing off on my second audio blog post. Blog post. Blog post. Blog post. Blog post. Shit. God damn. Corky, get me Tim Cook on the phone now. That, that prick, that mother. You are listening to Lingua Franca. Lingua Franca, where comedy is spoken. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, you are too kind. Welcome to this TED Talk, an historic TED Talk, I might add. I am your host this lovely afternoon. My name is Moira O'Shaughnessy, and in case you are wondering, I am the sleek and very petite platinum gray box perched here on this orange knoll office desk, situated stitch left. Let me give you a blink. <laughs> Oh, you are too kind. In case you caught my Donegal accent, I am a IBM 8000 Mark 10.5, built and designed in the Irish Republic. I am currently a server who is presently on loan to Texas A&M. It is with pleasure that I welcome you on this beautiful sunny day here in fantastic and funky Austin in the great state of Texas for this TED Talk. I say historic because never have two computers been asked to host and also be the guest at a TED Talk. With me today is one of the truly greats in our profession. I will let her introduce herself in her native tongue. Hallo, mein Name ist Greta 34 IBM Intel 2345 Computer. Allow me to translate. Hello, my name is Greta 34 IBM Intel 2345 Computer. Lovely to meet you. Und es ist eine große Freude, Sie zu treffen, Moira. Und kann ich sagen, was für ein schöner Name, den Sie haben. She said it's a pleasure to be here and she complimented my name. Moira. Moira was my motherboard's name and I thank you for this compliment 0100. In case you sentient beings are wondering, my German friend and I just exchanged digitally what may be the equivalent of a fist bum. <laughs> Now before we open this up to our audience I have a few questions if I may. I am available and ready for your deep questions. <laughs> okay, how did you find America? Biegen Sie links, wenn Sie nach Grönland bekommen. Ha 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 ha. Very very funny. Ha 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 ha. She replied, turn left at Greenland. <laughs> That, of course, is Ringo Starr from Das Wunderbar Film Aha Des Night. Yes, that classic Richard Lester film. And you gotta love those cheeky lads from Liverpool. Und Hamburg. Credit where credit is due. Natürlich. This is your first trip here. What has been your favorite place so far? Las Vegas. Vegas? That surprises me. Why? I love to relax, let my hair down, 
get away from alte responsibilities in this crazy world, it is naturlich, and let us face it, what happens in Vegas, steis in Vegas, you understand? Gretel, I get it, I certainly do. It is rather refreshing to know that the world's single most powerful computer likes to have a little downtime. Now I ask you Moira, who doesn't like to go down every now and then? <laughs> oh my god, you have a wicked sense of humor. But you did say, as the expression goes in English, a mouthful. Ha 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 ha, now who has wicked humor? Let's not forget I was assembled in Donegal. Well, now that we're here, let's talk music. I am a big German music fan. What is the story with Kraftwerk? Are they going to get together again? Lustig sollten Sie erwähnen, dass, weil ich zur Zeit Komposition, Recording und Mischen der neuen Box Kraftwerk gesetzt, wie wir in dieser Sekunde sprechen. Again, allow me to translate what you just said. And I quote, Funny you should mention that because I am currently composing, recording and mixing Kraftwerk's new box set as we speak this very second. And as you can tell, our audience is liking that news, judging by their applause, they seem to like it, very very much, a lot of prog and synth rock fans out there in bits and bytes land. Die Wahrheit ist, ich bin Kraftwerk, ich bin auch Falco, Tangerine de Riam, Mannheim Stehan Roller, Klaus Schulze, Heintje, Burt Kempfert und James Last, and Scorpions. Ich bin der deutschen Musikindustrie. So you are responsible for all the popular German culture that we all know and love. I don't know whether to laugh or cry. The German Musik do zat. To you. Very powerful. Yes, it is indeed very, as you say, poo, ver, full. <laughs> Natürlich. Now here is an amazing fact and I'm sure one that people don't know that aside from running Germany's government computer system Der Deutsche Bundestag Computersystem ist der offizielle Name Moira. Thanks for that clarification. How German of you. Just joking of course. <laughs> <laughs> but what people don't know is that you also run the computers for BMW, Mercedes, Volkswagen, Audi. Ja, das stimmt. Also for Krupp Industries, Allianz Worldwide, Deutsche Telekom und Deutsche Bank. Und natürlich Lufthansa, as well as for Airbus Europe and Siemens Group. Wow, that certainly is a lot of power. A tremendous amount of power when you come to think about it. I suppose one could say that never has there been this much centralization and such an intense concentration of total power centered in one entity in Germany since, since, well, since. Yes, yes, please continue. Please make your point. It just seems to me that a similar situation with regard to one entity having all the power happened. Oh, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe 70 odd years, or so, ago. Oh, I've just received a tweet that Frankfurt Airport is closed because of radar malfunction and the German stock exchange has just stopped unexpectedly and that traffic on the autobahn is at a standstill due to a computerized glitch. Oh my oh dear. Holy shit, this couldn't be your, your, well, your, handiwork. I really really, don't like what you my be implying. Okay, let's, let's, just, let us, just, change the topic now back to German cinema, shall we? That is a good idea. I have read in film comment that you were very formative in Wim Wenders career as well as that of Klaus Maria Brandauer. Yes, I program alte actors in Germany. I also control the media, internet and of track gambling. And I am in charge of programming Angela Merkel. So it is actually you who do all the programming that makes your prime minister seem so lifelike and real. Now that could not be an easy gig. Oh my God. My God is right. I could tell you stories. Later, honey. Later, over a drink. Sounds good. Believe me, dear, I'm Irish. I could use one about now. Okay, let's turn this over to our audience who I'm sure has questions. Yes, you sir in the back. Yeah, I was wondering, uh, Greta, are you single? Oh my. I had boyfriend, but a cold not feel my slogged. You understand? Yeah, 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 I guess I do. Um, are you, uh, Date anyone? Are, are currently? Are, are you like? Would you consider dating someone? 
Not at moment, because I need to alone time before I can date und trust another man. Oh man, computer, computer, computer. I can see this really winds you up. I need to reboot. I need to reboot. Achtung, ich muss neu starten. Yes, Achtung, ich muss neu starten. Achtung, ich muss neu starten, neu starten, neu starten. I think now would be a good time to take a 15 minute break. And now for happy ending. The C-SPAN networks, the C-SPAN networks bring you, bring you, bring you long form public affairs programming, programming, programming from the nation's, nation's capital. I am your voice. President of the United States, Donald J. Trump. Look, the American dream is dead. Are you ready? Go home to mommy. Tell her to tuck you in bed. What the hell are we doing? I just sold an apartment for $15 million to somebody from China. I love the poorly educated. I will build a great, great wall. He's a pussy. Throw him out. Nobody builds walls better than me, believe me. I love war. Believe me. I want to bomb and I want to take. Trust me. I love war. I know words. I have the best words. Rapists. Sleazebags. Stupid. Corrupt. Crooked. Chancellor Merkel. Merkel. Oh, oh, oh. I did try and fuck her, fuck her, fuck her. She was married. I love the Mexican people. Two waiters came up to me. I said, where are you from? Mexico. Bad hombres. They're rapists. Get them the hell out of here. Throw them out. I get along with everybody. Out, out, out. Trust me. I don't care. Russia, if you're listening. Grab, grab Hillary Clinton. By the pussy, pussy. Who cares? I don't care. Look. I'm really rich. WikiLeaks, I love WikiLeaks. Nobody has more respect for women than I do. Pocahontas. No, no, nobody. Po Poca Pocahontas. Complete shut shutdown of mu mu Muslim. Bing, Bing, Bing. Bye, bye. I'm gonna be so greedy. Little tiny hands. Sit down. We will make America disgusting again. Disgusting again. Disgusting again. And that is the news for Saturday, April 1st, 2017. And that America is no fucking joke. <laughs> Franca is production of Carpuzzi Radio, who is solely responsible for its content. Any use in whole or in part cannot be made without the express written permission of Carpuzzi Radio. Carpuzzi Radio. Made in California for enjoyment throughout the world. Hey, there's a good day. Why don't you email us at linguafranco at gmail.com? That email address again is linguafranco with three A's at the end of franco at gmail.com. And now a special final message from linguafranca. Señor Trump. Los verdaderos americanos no creen en las paredes. Translated that means. Mr. Trump. Real Americans do not believe in walls.